Delacqua to the floating stadium. Come in, floating stadium. Yeah, we read you, boss. Loud and clear. Nothing to report down here. I'm coming back. No, wait! But guys, it's so rad! It says here, the Austronesian people built it over a thousand years ago. Shakes, dude, I was amped for our trip to East Malaysia. Yeah, pretty cool place to anchor the floating stadium. But they have to listen to you riff on about these ruins all the way from Strikerland and get this. The ruins slipped onto the Pacific seabed during a massive earthquake. Make it stop! And now it's in a dry dome, so archaeologists can research it. Maybe we can convince Del Aqua to take us down there. Huh? Forget the lost legend shakes and focus on Super Striker's own living legend, El Matador! <clears throat> hey, even legends can have a one-off bad game. <sighs> Awkward. Fine. Three one-off bad games in a row. But my luck is about to change. Uh. Super Strikers! Some say a bird pooping on you is good luck. Really? Your problem has nothing to do with luck, El Meta Dude. Oh, please. Against Technicali, I laced my boots up using my Tuesday configuration. No wonder I played badly. Then, during the Cosmos game, I found out Ninja bought the same Lamborghini as me. No! no! You expect me to be able to concentrate on... Oh, yeah! Whoa! What is that, Mom? A whale farting, maybe? No, that's the air from the dome. They purge it when oxygen levels get too low. Then suck fresh air back down there. So our team of archaeologists can continue unlocking the secrets of the ruins. Coach Del Aqua? Ahoy there! <laughs> Let's get you settled in. So what were the ruins built for? It's an amphitheater. Public meetings, perhaps? Mm. Celebrations? Entertainment? And how long can someone stay down there at a time? Only 30 minutes before the dome floods and the air automatically purges. Whoa! The moon pool room. Uh, that's right. It's the base of our ruins operation. That's where you launch the aquapods from. Simon to the moon pool room, Simon to the moon pool room. Uh, Self-decompressing, solar-powered, max depth 200 meters, right? Wow, you really do know your stuff, Shakes. Yeah, all thanks to the nerd manual. Good old National Aquatic. Every last detail, hey? So, any chance we get to go down there? What does it say in your manual? Uh. Archaeologists only? We must do all we can to preserve such a precious archaeological site. That's why we have Simon here. What's up, Mr. Delacqua, sir? Simon is in charge of Moonpool security today. But I was hoping to watch the game. Oh, you can still watch the game. Match day at the floating stadium. Ugh, so close to the action, but so far. Yeah, I know how you feel. What a spectacular setting for this Super League doubleheader, Mac. Indeed, Brenda. Off the coast of East Malaysia and above mysterious ruins. Get me the ball, guys. I'm feeling lucky. Yes! El Matador sets his sights on the Hydra goal. My luck. What do you mean? I'm on the verge of breaking my dry spell, and Hydra come up with some impenetrable defense! Come on, El Matador. Enough with the excuses. The only person responsible for your form is you. Hydra take the first encounter by only a narrow margin. And despite being surrounded by water, El Matador's drought continues. <sighs> Can 
this day just end, please? Yeah, easier said than done. This is crazy. Oh. Delacqua may be at the forefront of research at sea. Yeah, but he sure ain't at the forefront of comfort at sea. Guys, please, we need to be rested for practice tomorrow. Don't worry, Captain. I've been reading up on the science of sleep. Hit yeah, what yes, you got? Please. Method one, sleep in your socks. Research shows warm feet mean better sleep. <sighs> I guess it's worth a shot. Wow, Klaus, your sleep science actually works. Yep, I feel good as new. What did I tell you guys? Vlog, vlog. Okay, okay, Block. We try something different tonight, yeah? Right. I have three ways to get us some goals against Hydra. Over the top. Come on, Shakes. Run it the in. nerd manual isn't going to help us beat Hydra, okay? But first up, we're going to create space in the middle by using Shakes and El Matador as decoys. <gasps> decoys? But then how? How I... do you break your dry spell? Your dry spell is our dry spell. We break it together. Me? A decoy? No. I'm a glorious gold getter, a stylish sharpshooter. I am not a decoy. Huh? Now, heads up, sleepyhead. Uh. Sorry, North Dude. Water, perhaps? Whoa, <laughs> grub. Oh. What a loser. Can't score any goals. Bird poop on me. At least I still have my glorious hair. Oh. So beautiful, huh? Hydra players in the nerd dome? Whoa! <coughs> Guys, I, I think I know how Hydra are stopping me from scoring goals. Let me guess. You forgot to wear your lucky underpants? You put your boots on the wrong feet? Is it because it's full moon or something? No, 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 guys, listen. El Matador. Change your clothes and your attitude, or you're on the bench tomorrow. Method two, listening to soothing sounds will put you right to sleep. Huh, makes me want to go surfing. Makes me want to go to the toilet. Hey, anyone seen my National Aquatic? Oh, shut up, everybody, and go to sleep, please! So, tomorrow we can implement our team-oriented strategy against Hydra. <clears throat> Archaeologists only, my butt. Okay, so I grab a submarine thingy, zip down to the door. Ah! Shut, Shut up! up! Why the sudden interest in the nerd dome? I uh, discovered a new sleep technique. Reading about boring old ruins. <gasps> okay, confession. Doodling helps me sleep. It's match day at the luxurious Cosmos universe. Can the home team outmaneuver Ion Tank's brute force and tactics? Uh, mm -hmm. Get out of the pod, El Matador. No shakes. I figured out how Hydra beat us. So get out of the pod and we can talk about it. The reason their defense is so good is because they've been training down there. Wow, that is a crazy excuse for playing badly, even by your standards. It's not an excuse, shakes. You heard Delacqua. Only archaeologists are allowed in the dome. That's all lies. Anyone can go down there. <laughs> Ah! <laughs> 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 
of oxygen. You have 15 minutes of oxygen. Only 15 minutes? Good thing we didn't bring the whole team down, right? Whoa! I know. Looks like Del Aqua didn't tell National Aquatic everything. Goalposts, field markings, and defenders. And soccer balls. How about we do some research of our own? We figure out a way past these stones. We figure out how to beat Hydra. And I break my gold drought once and for all. Do the honors. It will be my pleasure. One minute of oxygen. Okay, time to get out of here. Come on, Chase. We've almost got it. <laughs> huh? Initiating air purge. <laughs> yeah, we need to get out of here now. <laughs> <laughs> Chase, please tell me you know what to do. I haven't finished reading. <laughs> <laughs> I guess that's the first truly aquatic, national aquatic! <laughs> A dream! Oh, that's all! Ah! Dude, get up! We overslept! Hey, looks like method two worked a charm! Tonight, method three! <laughs> Research shows having a caregiver watching over you makes you sleep easier. Listen up, boys. Tonight we sleep. <gasps> Hi, coach. Bye, coach. You two have some explaining to do. You remember the plan, right? Yeah, I know what to do. And there's these crazy stone circles that move back and forth. But for real, they're like actually defenders. And it's kind of like playing against Hydra, but... Whoa, 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 El Matador. And you, Shakes? What did you see down there? Well, the dome purged as I arrived. But it just looked like beautiful ruins to me. What? So, you only went down there to save El Matador's hide? Yeah, I was scared he'd get stuck. Oh, Shakes, you're such a hero. Seems your attitude hasn't changed at all, El Matador. You know the deal. Ah! The bench? Please, coach, not the bench! Great performance, El Matador. Next step, convince Coach. Match day at the Floating Stadium. <sighs> and El Matador is on the bench. Simon, why not watch this game for real? Really, Coach Delacqua? Yes. I think our little security threat has been eliminated. El Matador's on the bench, and his body language speaks volumes, Mac. Looks to me like it's still saying, dry spell. Okay, boys. The decoy. Okay, over the 
on top. All right, run it in. So, you were right about Hydra modeling their defense on the ruins. I know. But, Shakes, you said we that... We couldn't let Del Aqua know what we saw in the dome, Coach. And we needed me on the bench. Let me guess. So you can go down there and figure out a way through the stones. Yeah, but won't Del Aqua notice if El Matadude's not there in the second half? Klaus has that covered. Yeah. Uh, I do? Hydra have fended off every Super Striker's attack so far. The coach is sticking to his game plan. El Matador is still on the bench. Aye, and his body language is even worse than it was in the first half. Seems the once great striker has given up on breaking his dry spell. You have 30 minutes of oxygen. Strikers build the pressure by pushing players forward. But the higher the pressure, the quicker the release. Super Strikers rush back to defend. No! Oh, it's too late! No! No! Yeah, no kidding. I can almost smell the whale fart. <clears throat> Correction. Huh? You have 30 seconds of oxygen. One minute divided by you. Please, Mr. Matador, put the pickaxe down, okay? No. Yes. No. Yes. <gasps> no. Initiating air purge. Help! Don't worry. I've done this before. <laughs> Who's finally off the bench, Brenda? Much more positive body language from El Matador. And did your crazy plan work? I have a theory, but there's only one way to test it. Get you the ball. <laughs> Could there be any other way? Last ditch effort from Coach sending on El Matador. I can't imagine moping around on the bench has done anything for his form, Brenda. All you, El Matador. El Matador. Oh, yeah. Come on. What are you waiting for? Perfect moment. Just shoot! And now. We'll be sending a few, um, updates through to National Aquatic. Yeah, soon the secrets of the ruins will be accessible to everyone. Simon? Simon! You're off Moon Pool security. Forever! <gasps> Two goals in one game? What a return to port for El Matador! Aww. 
So, El Matadu, you finally broke your dry spell. Sure, but the really important thing is that we won. Just kidding! I broke my dry spell! I broke my dry spell! <laughs> hey, uh, could I borrow your hair dryer? My National Aquatic needs a drying spell. <laughs> yeah. Not funny. I'm really looking forward to getting some rest. Method three, here we go. I don't think that'll be necessary. Turns out the best way to get to sleep is soccer. <laughs> Am I right, Klaus? <laughs> Guys, that thing's about to blow a hole right through our planet. What do we do, guys? Aim for the mothership. Shaft. You are Earth's last hope, Joe. I believe in you! You got this! Hey, aliens, you want some fun? Have a ball! Cut! That line is the worst! The climax needs more oomph, more boom, more kablam! Uh, a uh, little help, please, Mr. Director. This veggie just went up, uh, intergalactic! I am tired. I am hungry. I need the bathroom. Out of the way! Great work, guys! That was amazing, fantastic, bada boom! But it also, you know, it sucked. Huh? Shakes, your line is the climax, the blammo of the whole shebang! The line has to wham! So tonight, I'll be perfecting that line. Because tomorrow, we make magic. Kaboom! <clears throat> Mr. Plosion? Tomorrow, we play Invincible United. We agreed you would wrap your shoot today. Ouch, don't worry. Nothing could prepare your guys better. Have you seen their moves? They're like boom, bam, pow! Hmm, it's true they are working on accuracy, and the suspension scenes could improve their aerial game. Exactly. Now, have you tried the chocolate croissants? They are... <laughs> All gone. After thorough analysis of Super Striker's on form player, I've identified what is setting Shakes apart. You mean besides being a total dork? Sonia, please. Rather than taking on the defense, there's a 47% probability Shakes will attempt a long range shot. It's simple Shakes scores more goals because he takes more shots. Hmm. Yes! <laughs> Dig gone! From the people who brought you Strike Team. Give me that comes a motion picture about family. Mommy, mommy, what is that? Fear. Uh, our planet is simply in their way. Fate. We're out of options, people. We need them again. And football. From Maverick director, Al Explosion, and starring Super Strikers, Strike Team 2, a soccer lips now. Ha! Those losers made another stupid movie? They're almost done filming. Imagine being football stars and movie stars. Sonia? In conclusion, Shakes is the danger man. You have to neutralize him before he shoots. Thank you. Man, this acting gig is actually kind of boring. It's too easy. Just pretending you're someone you're not. Oh, blargo. But life on set has its perks. <laughs> Only some perks are better than others. Right, El Matador? Ah! All right. 
Which one of you has been using my private luxury toilet? Not me. I use the portal loom. I use the one on set. I use the one built into my suit. Uh, you have a toilet in your spacesuit? Yeah, of course. Uh, your guys' acting skills are pretty good. But I will find the culprit. Let's get the ball rolling. Nah. Time to kick up a storm. Lame. Think, Alex, think. Open your eyes and shut your trap. It's time to put on your thinking cap. I'll give it a shot. Yes, that's it. <laughs> huh? Hello, uh, we're done for the day? Get out of here. Picture this, a young, overrated Super League striker. Stars in a big movie. But one day on set, a harness snaps! Tragic! Or maybe he gets locked in a dressing room. Help, help, I'm a big baby, boo-hoo! No one heard his cries, but the director received a load of cash for his next big movie. Hey, I built my career on two things. Kablam! Macho explosions, and boom! Honesty. Can you even spell honesty? H-O-N-E-S-T-Y? Huh? And do you have any idea how hard I've worked? How many Shablamo movies I've made? How many people I've had Look out! off my sets? Mr. Plosion, everything okay? Yeah, Jerry, everything's fine. Thought I heard something. Must have been a little kitty cat. Mew, 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 mew. <laughs> I love that song. What song, doofus? H-O-N-E-S-T-Y? Because we do the right thing! H-O-N-E-S-T-Y? Because we love to sing! H-O-N-E-S-T-Y! Mr. Plosion was singing a song from Crocky the Smilo Dial. You mean that stupid show from when we were kids? Yeah, and he sounded just like Crocky. Okay, let's do this! All right! All right. Oh, strike team! Guess what? I had security cameras installed on my trailer! Again with the mystery toilet user? I'll give it up, El Matador! Let's see, fast forward, blah, blah, blah. Ah, prime time after our morning coffee break. Oh! Big Bo! How could you? <laughs> what can I say? That is one great place to practice my lines. Okay, line. What is your line, Big Bo? It's a... Oh, man. Line! Bombs, Bombs away. away! Right, yeah. Bombs away! Hmm. <sighs> Updated script from Alex. Got it. Show off. Bada boom! Final scene, take two. And action! The only way in is that ventilation shaft. Think you can save the world, Joe? I believe in you! You got this! Urgent package for you, Alex. Not now, Evan. <laughs> Who's Ashley Nutterbutt? Huh? Huh? <gasps> I'll give it a yeah! shot. Cut. cut. That's it. You can't cut now. Clear the set. The match is tonight. Coach, the uh, the line still needs work. You know how it is. Perfection takes time. <sighs> Well, as long as they finish in time for the game. Okay, back in 10, everybody. <laughs> Mom, are you videoing this? Hey, friendly friends. No. Today, someone asked me to tell a lie, but I said no. Do you know why? Not Crocky. H-O-N-E-S-T-Y. Because we do the right thing. H-O-N-E-S-T-Y. Because we love to sing. H-O-N-E-S-T-Y! He's got me to slide down! I was young and stupid! Golly wow, friendly friend. I wonder if this video could ruin your macho reputation. <laughs> Don't bother, nutter butt. We made copies. Yeah, and now you have to sign my thinking cap. <laughs> I'll never take it off. All right. What do you want me to do? <laughs> and action! The only way in is that ventilation shaft! Think you can save the world, Jones? I believe in you! Got this! I'll give it a shot! Uh, come on, brother! 
Um, I've read that you scored the most goals this season, Shakes. All we need here is one. Take four. And action! <laughs> and... Nothing fancy, Shakes. Just get it in the hole. Take five. Focus on the ball, Shakes. But also focus on the target. Take six. Keep your head down, brother. Yeah, but keep your eyes up. Don't overthink it. Just relax. I mean, don't underthink it either, right? So, take seven. Take eight. Take 32. Take 56. Take a break? Can we take a break, Alex? No! Okay, okay, I'll do it. Ah, forget it! The only reason you lot are here is your soccer skill. It's not like you can oh. act or anything. We'll finish the scene in post. That's a wrap, everyone. Wait, we're done? That's what wrap means. Woo! Yeah, no more time. wedgies! Hey, you think there'll be food at this party? Food at this party? Food at this party? Food at this party? <laughs> 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 Shakes. Shakes. Shakes! <laughs> you still off saving the world, Jones. I guess I am pretty spaced out, Captain. Our fans aren't here to watch us fly around with pretend jetpacks. They're here to watch us do what we do best. So let's trade these tuxedos for something more our style. Time for some real action. Uh, El Mata dude, locker room is that way. Uh -huh. Why would I use our stinky old locker room when luxury awaits? Bomb uh, away! Uh, <laughs> it's all yours, El Matador. <laughs> <laughs> this summer, one group of footballers must face another group of footballers in an epic battle for possession! Mac, this isn't a movie trailer. It's Invincible United versus Super Strikers. Hey there, friendly friend. Ah! He's fucking Smilo <laughs> So? At the start of a game, it's always 50-50. Unless you can neutralize the danger man. Hmm. We'll see. Invincible United have their box on lockdown. They're like an army. But an army is no match for one man on the edge of the box. They do call him the Long Ranger. Huh? Focus on the ball. Focus on the target. Keep your head down, brother. But keep your eyes up. All we need here is one. one, one. Yeah. Take eight, take nine, take 32, take 56. Anytime you're ready, Shake. Yes! Take the shot! What? No! Shakes passes back instead of shooting! Ah! <laughs> He walks off defeated, but Shakes will return in the sequel. You mean the second half, Mac? That's what I said, Brenda. Huh? He's cocky, the smile dial. Then you're looking for a friend. And you've been searching a while. It's, it's time, time to, to play, play with Crocky, the smile dial. I love <laughs> that show! I mean, 
loved. <laughs> of course. In the uh, past. That's what I meant too. <laughs> <laughs> Today, I met the real Crocky. What? He signed my thinking cap and everything. You met Ashley Nutterbutt. This is Alex Plosion's signature. Yeah, Alex and Ashley are the same person. What? <laughs> That's another thing I learned today. <sighs> I hope none of those strategies include me, Coach. Think I've forgotten how to score goals. Yeah, I never thought I'd say this, but can you please stop passing to me? Uh, missing all those shots on set today really messed with my head. Then you've tried your best. But you look like a jerk. Lift your head, puff your chest, and just get back to work. What is that, dude? It's a cheer up song from Crocky's A Smile O Dial. <laughs> from when we were little kids. <laughs> that show was lame. I stopped watching it before I learned to walk. Please, it's a classic. And did you know Alex Plosion was Crocky? <laughs> <laughs> no way. The lame O Dial? Hey, people still love Crocky, all right? I mean, Dingan got his thinking cap signed by Alex just today. That can't be. We were shooting all day. Yeah, doing that scene over and over. Crazy. Nice try, Big Bo. But I got you on poop cam. Give it a rest, El Matador. Yeah, now's not the time, okay? Guys, wait. Let me see that footage. Dingan was on set, and not without his babysitters. Huh, what were those dudes doing on our movie set? Coach? Oh, no, 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 no. There's no way you'll make it to the set and back before the second half. <laughs> I beg to differ. <clears throat> okay, okay. Whoa, it's Bruno! Okay, that is really sweet. I have a theory. I just need to... Ah! That stung a little. Almost! Hmm? Almost! Ah! Hello? Oh, sure. I can take a survey. Okay, higher. No, lower. Higher, higher. Yep. One man. No. Two men in red missing. Huh? Huh? Sabotage. There's a plastic cover. The shot was impossible. Yay, it wasn't your fault, Chase. Invincible United must have put Alex up to this. Uh. Ah! Alex, you're... Kind of blocking our awesome getaway? I can't just let you vroom off into the night. Scar and Vince wouldn't like that. They might tell the world my little secret. What? That you were Crocky the smile dial What? How did you- But Crocky was awesome. He- he was? Sure. Uh, yeah. Everyone knows you were the most popular TV amphibian ever. Reptile. Still, my reputation as a kapow director could be ruined. No, Crocky's legendary, man. Yeah, everyone's favorite TV show. When they were babies. And all this time I've been embarrassed. So, are we cool? Friendly friend? Abandoned by the ones they trusted most. I'm sure Shakes and El Matador will be back any minute, Mac. Crocky dance! <laughs> <laughs> El Matador, your acting was awesome back there. No, your performance was amazing. No, you were amazing. No, okay, I was amazing. So, you up for one last amazing performance? They're back, and this time... They're playing football, like last time. So, where you been, Shakes? Uh, after that first half, I wasn't sure I could carry on. Oh, I needed an extra long halftime break. Leave him alone, Skyra. Hasn't he been through enough?
Time is ticking for Super Strikers. And there's only one unmarked man in red. Not surprisingly, it's Shakes. You ready to save the world, Jones? Huh? I'll give it... No! A shot! Incredible response from the audience. You must be so proud. Thanks, Lena. Now, tell me, is it true you were Crocky the smile at all? As a matter of fact, I was. <laughs> that show was so bad. Hey, Alex. Hey, Joanne, SD. Why did you even make that stupid show? But you guys said it was awesome. <laughs> it's a little thing called acting. It's not our fault we're so good at it. Boom! Hey! I'm the one who talks in explosion noises! <laughs> Kablam! Ooh, a movie premiere! 80% chance of fun! <sighs> and there's a 90% chance the Soccer Lips Now will be a box office hit. <sighs> and there's a 100% chance that I... You're fired! I've already called a cab. Matador is the best player. He the ha ha ha! The Super League takes a week off, and I can finally get rid of this hideous sock tan. Ah. Mm. Ah. Ah. Super League News Blast, come on! I'm on holiday here! Hello, Super Leaguers! Miss Altivo? If it isn't Miss Entertainment herself... What's she up to this time? You're all super talented, but have you ever wondered who really is the best? Duh. Well, here's your chance to find out! Your all you need to do is film your latest trick and upload the video. The Super Leaguer with the most views wins the grand prize. <gasps> oh. <gasps> Supercar of the future, the Maximo Stallion. The Maximo's real? I heard space engineers built the prototype. Imagine the speed. Imagine the power. Imagine how good it will look with me in it. Hm. You all disgust me. Especially you, Bruno. Entries closed 24 hours before the awards ceremony. Contest open to Super League players only. Whoa! I'm your official cameraman, okay, Shakes? I can see it now. First move, round the no world. No way, Spins. Coach said we must use this week to relax. No soccer. Yeah, yeah. Not even Super League 4000X. <laughs> Sorry, buddy. For the record, this is lame. <laughs> <sighs> We've been invited to a barbecue at Dancing Rasta's house. <laughs> you mean I've been invited. Come on. I want to see what crazy tricks the other strikers are coming up with. Uh, these are professional footballers. There's no ways they'd waste time with stupid trick videos. Oh, yeah.
with the can, Skara. Because I was aiming for the Stelliano. <laughs> wow, Miss Altivo. Look at all these entries. But still no sign of shakes. Why do we need shakes? Entries are coming in thick and fast. Views are on the rise. Thousands of views. Thousands? Devin, Susan's Cats in Pajamas video has got a million views since lunch. Good job, Susan. Thank you, Miss Altivo. Thank you, Miss Altivo. Altivo Entertainment isn't here for just a few clicks. Right. What we want is global attention. Every screen, every eyeball. And how do you think we'll get it, Devin? Uh, cats? Celebrities. Funny videos. Funny videos of celebrity cats. No. It's conflict, Devin. The world wants to see conflict. Okay, I think I finally got it. What the weird? Are what those tigers? Yeah, tiger dude. What is this? My latest trick is a sequence of smaller tricks. It requires creativity, planning, and perfect execution. Whoa! My comb? I've been looking for that. Every trick needs the one before it to work perfectly. The slightest miscalculation and... Ah. Oh, so close, oh, Tigers! Keep at it, dude! Guys, Miss Altivo is counting down the top three tricks! Your latest trick videos are blowing up. Stand by for our current top three. <coughs> Coach. <laughs> These tricks had better not interfere with your rest before the Invincible United game. Nah, nah, we're totally chill. We're just blowing off steam. It's our way of relaxing. Good. Now move. I can't see the screen. And without further ado... Three. North Shaw. <laughs> A golden man in red. Pigeon shooting, El Matador style. Hold! Too easy. That was so hard! 126 shots, but I finally did. Oh, uh, we can cut that last part out, right? <laughs> <laughs> nice one, El Matador. Hey, guys, grubs up. If you can catch. What? Oh, you're oh, kidding! Not, Scar. not him! Behold the awesomeness. <laughs> Pretty good. Uh, I've seen better. More like your lamest trick. Yeah, why is he at number one? Hey, do I smell something burning? Yeah, a sick Ooh. burn. Oh, shit! He got you there, you man. You gotta admit, that's kind of funny. You're not gonna let him get away with that, are you? You knows he got you there, James. <laughs> Fine. Get me a ball. <laughs> Just make sure you get this from a decent height, Spence. That was uh, did good, Shakes. You did real good. Not quite a billboard nose blaster, but okay. It's on, Scara. Woohoohoo! We finally got shakes! So, what do we do now, Devin? Celebrate? Ooh, ooh, we can have balloons! <gasps> and Susan can bake a cake decorated with... No, Devin. We've initiated conflict. Now, we intensify it. And I know just the guy for the job. Yo! Wanna make videos, get views, and go viral? Then you come to the right face! I'm Jordy, your goofy guide to internet stardom. The most important thing about creating your latest trick is showmanship. You've got to make it look cool, hot, weird, wacky, kablam! Ooh. Yeah! yeah. <laughs>
<laughs> Next up, to get a strong audience response, you need to respond. And there are only two correct reactions. Confident indifference, AKA the thug. Or crazy celebration. You just gotta go bazonkers! Last, confront your enemy. Stoke the fire of jealousy by dropping lines on a diss track. Don't even matter if you can't rap. Right, let's do this, ninja. Uh, ninja? Come on. He says it doesn't matter if you can't rap. Ah, you're so vain. Listen up, punk. Do you know your tricks are junk? The last one stunk. Fame is shrunk. Career sunk like an old ship. Take a hot tip. Bite your lip because you ain't prepared. Are you cold or just running scared? Shivering at shakes. Ha <laughs> ha, you ain't got what it takes. Nods like a lapdog, hair like a hedgehog. Yeah, I'm taking aim, taking names, taking down in flames while you just sit there playing video games. Yes! Skara is nailing it again. <laughs> oh, Devon. The fun's only just starting. Okay, you guys ready? Uh-huh. Yep. Let's do this. And action! Haha, <laughs> you think your rhymes are so ill? Think you burned my nostril? Ha, well, I'll show you a burn, Skara, and I'm just warming up. Yeah, yeah, we're heating up like it's tropical. You're spitting hate because you like a troll. I'm laughing at you because you're comical. Well, my lyrics keeping topical. Doing tricks like there's no obstacle. Don't second guess me because I'm in control. Uh, uh, <clears throat> What up, son? Your rap is done. But if you want another rhyme, try... Why aren't you relaxing at home like I told you? Coach, if I don't finish this video, Scar is gonna win the competition. The deadline's tonight. And the United game is tomorrow. What's more important to you, Shakes? Come on, Shakes. Where are you? Yes! Time's up and we have a clear winner. Well, rules are rules. I guess we should pack up, go home, and get some rest, right? Well, I haven't really slept in three Wrong, days. Wrong, Devon. This is our competition, and we make the rules. Match day at Strike-A-Land. And everyone's in town for the Your Latest Trick Awards ceremony tonight. Pretty obvious who's gonna win, right? Super Striker should have the advantage on home. Not the game, Riano. I mean, Your Latest Trick. Oh, yeah. Skara is miles ahead. <laughs> I can't believe I've come all this way, and that pipsqueak has trumped us all. I don't care who wins. I'm just here for tonight's party! <laughs> <laughs> Gotta say, even though Skara is getting the Maximo, I'm just glad this competition's over. <laughs> Me too, Shakes, dude. Yeah, you and Skara are going nuts. You even tried to rap. Yeah, what were we thinking? Huh? You've seen the tricks, the triumphs, and the tragedy. But two players stood out from the rest. So, to decide who really deserves the Maximo, we're extending the deadline till the ceremony tonight. <laughs> don't worry, coach. And don't forget, your views decide your latest tricks winner. So rewatch your favorites as many times as you like. What you doing there, Mac? <laughs> Nothing, Brenda. Uh, look, the game's starting. And it's El Matador in the danger zone. Whoa! Thrilling start to the game. But the fans don't seem interested. Absolutely unacceptable, Brenda. <clears throat> <laughs> I have a plan to distract Shakes. Hey! Do 
Yuma sends it to Skara. Hey, North. Check out my latest trick. Ah, uh, dude. <laughs> Phenomenal skill from the forward. But a weak shot on goal. Perfect. Yes! Your turn, Shakes. <laughs> oh, it's on. <laughs> with the tricks, not yourself. Whatever. No ways I'm letting Shakes get that stop on him. No! Oh, and it's off the crossbar! Duma pushes Skara out of his way, picks the ball up off the rebound, and... <laughs> Shakes my. Not yet, anyway. Guys, look. I've been a little selfish. More like spectacularly uh, selfish. No kidding. Uh, All right, uh, I'm sorry, but I have an idea. Remember Twisting Tiger's sequence of tricks? Uh -huh. Sure, I still don't have my comb back. Well, thanks to your latest trick, we've all got new moves, right? Interesting restart from Super Strike. They've sent it all the way back to the defense. Creativity, planning, and perfect execution. All right, Locke, now. Boys are cooking! Burger special! Get it while it's hot. What? <laughs> no way. Huh? Rock and roll! What was that? That's a little trick called teamwork. <laughs> That'll do, Shakes. Nice job ruining our chance of a win. And looks like it was all for nothing, too. What? That's so unfair. Shakes had his whole team helping him. Mr. Skara, we have a team that can help you. Who are you? See you later, Bruno. The atmosphere is electric at the Your Latest Trick Awards night. Mac, can we forget about commentating for once? Mind if I comment on the fact that Skara hasn't shown up? With Shake so far ahead, I don't blame him. The Staliano will suit you, my friend. You're both one of a kind. <laughs> I might actually have a shot. Uh, I think you mean we might have a shot. Team Trick, Team Car. I bag Saturdays. I got Tuesday. Ladies and gentlemen. Please take your seats and get ready for the grand finale of your latest trick! Funny thing happened after the game. Miss Altivo offered to help me make a new trick video. <laughs> Crazy, right? Let's have a look at our final scores. Wait, wait, wait. The competition organizer offered to help you. It looks like we have a clear winner. And uh, you don't think she made the same offer to anyone else? And the winner! Whoa there! Stop everything! What? This is most irregular, Mr. Skara. Sorry I'm late. Had to take a cab. Cause tonight, 
I'm driving home in the Stalliano. I suppose the contest hasn't been decided yet. Load it up, Devin. <gasps> Ooh. Huh? New video from Skara. Not gonna watch it. Not gonna watch it. Bonjour, monsieur. Go and fry an egg, you bosom faced poser. Ah, oh, Patty. They love me here. Anyway, here's my latest trick. <laughs> I call that one taking out the trash. Next level! What a trick! Yeah, Scala, you rock! <laughs> to Paris and back in two hours. Oh, special effects. <laughs> you are a natural. Yeah, bruv. I've like never even been to France. All El Tivo cares about is getting more views. And look, it's working. Good job, Devin. I did a good job. I did a good job! I did a good job! Ooh. Looks like we finally have a winner! Skara! Introducing the Maximo Staliano! <laughs> oh, dude, that is perfect! So teeny tiny. <laughs> she did say it was a prototype. Looks like Scarif not the only one who can do trick photography. <laughs> sure, Scarif made a fake video, but I'm the one who was really being fake. Sorry, I got so carried away, guys. That's all right. No problem. Shakes. Hey, we all get a little carried away sometimes, right? Oh, here's my ride. Ah, ninja. Nobody cares about your flashy motor vehicle. <gasps> Bruno. Bruno? 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 Where are you, Bruno? Where are you, Bruno? What have I done? <laughs> Bruno? I don't know what's going on. Huh? <laughs> Whatever, losers. I'm out of here. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that car, Mew Mew. It's the cutest little car I ever saw. Oh, look at that big kitty cat. Wardrobe! Bring the giant pajamas! believe we won in this cold. I and Tank were dominating. Yeah, if we didn't have Block, they would have destroyed us. Burger, burger. Too bad they didn't destroy that shirt he's wearing. <laughs> <laughs> what? Oh, come oh, on. Ah, no, Scotch. this is not going to be good for my hair. What's going on, guys? Bad news, dude. It's 40 degrees in Dubai. Whoa. Sultans thrive in the heat. When they play at home, no one can stop them. Come on, we beat Iron Tank in the cold, we'll beat Sultans in the heat. No, you won't. I'm calling the game off. You're oh, kind of no. Super League Extreme Conditions Clause. If the temperature exceeds 35 degrees, the match can be postponed. Come on, how bad can it be? See, it's actually kind of cool here. Nice try, Shakes. Postpone the game. But we've come all this way. Fans are gonna be bleak. Wait, coach, your sources must be mistaken because the world's bravest weatherman, Sonny Hailstrom, has a different prediction. <laughs> if you're lucky enough to be watching Celtics versus Super Strikers at Goliath Stadium tomorrow, it'll be a comfy 25 degrees. Ah, Wait, what? One minute it's 40. And now it's 25. You better believe it. Ooh, better believe it. <laughs> he always says that.
Sunny Hallestrom? Is he even a meteorologist? Doesn't he just, you know, read the cue cards? Well, his predictions are never wrong. And he's not afraid of anything. Yeah, check it out. I've got to warn you folks, stay indoors. This hailstorm, thunderstorm, tropical cyclone is extremely dangerous. To go out in this weather, you'd have to be a moron or a legend. Legend. Moron! Oh, oh not cool! No man. way, it's huh? 25! Oh, oh, oh. Talk about a home ground advantage! A warm welcome to the Goliath, Super Strikers! <laughs> Aircon! Aircon! My hair can't take this heat! There's no need to worry about your hair, Mr. Matador. Why do you agree with me, Sheik? 40 degrees is too hot for football. Oh, we won't have to call off the game, coach. We've made other arrangements. So Sonny was right. Maybe he's not a moron. But how could he have known? Because huh? it's my job to know. <laughs> Sonny Hellstrom at your weather service. <laughs> Sonny will monitor the temperature throughout our first air-conditioned match. Whoa. I knew you'd become a Sonny fan, Shakes. Not him, Strudelhead. The Goliath is amazing. <laughs> uh, fancy a little tour? Oh, oh, yeah. Let's go, oh, yeah. oh. Absolutely. Oh. <laughs> Welcome aboard the Goliath Sky Train. You are on the Arch Tour. Giant cogs close the roof, sealing Goliath off from the harsh desert conditions. Our highly trained temperature curators constantly monitor and maintain our state-of-the-art system. Hot and cold air ducts along the arch allow us to create the perfect climate for playing professional football. Ah, just the way me and my hair like it. Oh yes, the height of luxury is control. You had oh, me so a giant cock. So sweet. Ah! <laughs> Sorry, I always do that with first-timers. How's this for a bird's-eye view of the world's most luxurious stadium? You want to know a secret, Shakes? I still get scared out in those tropical storms. But the thing about fear is, if you don't face it, it gets worse. <sighs> A tour. This stadium is next level. Sheik, you are always upgrading. Yeah, but now how can you make Goliath any better? Oh, so nice. beautiful! <laughs> ah! huh. ah. I guess the height of luxury is. Control. <laughs> See you at kickoff tomorrow, Super Strikers. <laughs> Day at Goliath Stadium. The first match with the Sheik's new aircon. And to measure the temperature during the game, we have the world's bravest weatherman, Sonny Hellstrom. Big fan, Mac? Nah. Medium size at best, Brenda. Now remember, if the conditions get too extreme, the match can be called off. Well, folks, thanks to its remarkable cooling system, Goliath is a comfortable 25 degrees. And you... Better believe it! Ooh.
Ooh, can Saltons make an early impression on this game? Huh? Not if the Super Striker's defense can help it. Lock shows incredible composure under pressure. Ooh, and now the men in red have some space in the midfield. <laughs> 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 Shot. Conditions at the Goliath are giving both teams a fair chance. But as the first half progresses, the visitor's game is increasingly sluggish. Handle this much longer. My hair can't handle this much longer. Come on, Rev. It's clearly hotter than 25 degrees. Another reading, please, Mr. Hillstrom. Uh... <gasps> Still a comfy 25 degrees, folks. But, um, I suppose it is a little better. Losing your cool, coach? Or just losing? <laughs> I love it here at the Goliath. What are you talking about? We're one nil down. Still, lol. All because Goliath's cooling system doesn't work as advertised. Yeah, now we know why it's called Air Con. Ooh, look at my fancy air-conditioned stadium. Does he think we're stupid? That's it. I'm going up to that control room. Out of the question, Shakes. The refs made his decision. You said it yourself, Shakes man. We can beat Sultans in the heat, but we got to stick together. You know what's stuck together? My butt cheeks are stuck together. Yeah. Oh, man, yeah, I so hear you. Sweaty. My brain is melting. Mirror, mirror on the wall. Who's got the smoothest hair of all? El Mata, huh? <gasps> Shakes, brother, where's your mind at? <laughs> you left your shower running. Uh. Hmm. I'll just borrow a little shimmer mousse from Shakes. That guy's hair is a lost cause anyway. <laughs> Super Strikers are looking strong after the break. But can they keep it up? Mm. I'm on to you, Sheik. What's behind your back? What are you doing, Sheik's man? Forget him. No, Captain. I figured it out. Control is the greatest form of luxury? What are you talking about? The Sheik, he's... Getting away! Sheik's man! Warm up, Klaus. But I'm already warm, coach. Then get out there! Very clever, Sheik. Controlling the temperature to give your team the advantage. So sorry. What do you mean, Sheik's? Now you're gonna turn it down and have Sonny tell us it's still a comfy 25 degrees. Ah, you got me. But unfortunately, now, it's completely out of my hands. <laughs> hmm, a little more bravado than I anticipated. 40 degrees? Are you nuts? You said it would stay 25. Guaranteed. That's an additional complication. Shakes has the controller. Oh, he'll turn it down, obviously. Hm. You think he'll just take it down to 25? Please. He might prefer 21. Or even 19. But you'll be exposed. But a fraud. But a laughing stock. My reputation. You'd better believe it. Shakes, we can still win this. Huh? Well, 
Welcome aboard the Goliath Skytrain. Yes. You are on the roller coaster tour. Uh. It's a little warmer than Sunny says, Mac. Tell me about it, Brenda. Well, the heat certainly suits Sultans. Yes! <sighs> All right. Over to you guys. All right. Time to pick up the pace. It's working! Huh? Sonny, what are you doing? Quickly, Shakes! Let me in! Uh. Oh. Shakes! Help me! Thank you. That was foolish. Foolish? Then what do you call helping the Sheik with your false temperature readings? Please, I would never risk my reputation by giving a false report. But now that you and the Sheik are playing silly games, I have no choice but to take back control. So far, Matt. And now Super Strikers are pulling out some classic moves. They can make it look so easy. Summer is over, Shakes, and we're heading into an early fall. Uh, there! Just take it, you weirdo! Ha ha! Huh? Uh. You! The world trusted you, Sonny. And that's why... Yeah. I need you to be a good boy and hand over that controller. I can't believe people rely on you for the weather. You're the worst weatherman ever. How dare you! Did you hear something? Like someone screaming for help from far, far away? Hmm. Nah. You know, you're wrong about me. People don't just want the weather shakes. They want to know they'll be okay. Ice storms, tornadoes, gale force winds. In the end, they just want to know they'll be safe. So you see, I'm not just a weatherman. I give people peace of mind. Huh? this over with. <laughs> yes, block up! <laughs> My weather reports make people happy, Shakes. And no snot-nosed little soccer star is going to take that away from me. 
Nice speech, Sonny. What are you doing, Shakes? You know, the thing about fear is... Huh? If you don't face it... No! No, Shakes! Don't! It gets worse. Ah! This one's for messing with my hair! Too late, Super Strikers. Huh? <laughs> Legend. Huh? No. 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 Guys, to the tunnel. Match postponed due to extreme conditions. But the scoreboard, how did you... You know what they say around here. The height of luxury is control. <sighs> Look on the bright side, Sheik. Your stupid golf cart. It survived. <sighs> hey, guys. So, has anyone seen Sunny? <laughs> Hi, folks. Uh, I guess my reading was a little off. <laughs> but at least that storm made things a lot more exciting, hmm? right? You're the worst! Totally lame! You couldn't predict your own fart! Wait, no, listen, I... I can still fix this! Oh, my career is over! You'd better believe it! What did I tell you, dude? Okay, guys, let's get out of here! Blog of Zagalag, Blog Zag! Right. All my latest invention needs now is a little fine tuning. <laughs> huh? Huh? Ooh. Huh? Whoa! <laughs> uh <-huh. laughs> <laughs> 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 You clumsy klotzes, you hapless hippopotami! But Tony, this is really hard! Hard? You know what's hard? Being a genius surrounded by idiots! Seriously, how can we play football when we can't stay on our feet? Yeah, Tony, I just feel kind of out of control. That's it! My device will work. I just need a test subject who can handle being out of control. Nope. <laughs> but no. Pretty close, but, uh, aha! We have a winner! And by winner, I mean loser! <laughs> Super Sentence! Uh. 
boys are on top form. Take the rest of the day off. Thanks, Coach. Sweet. Yeah. <laughs> All right. See you back here on Monday. Wow, guys, wasn't that like the hottest you've ever got at practice? Yeah, even my sweat is sweating. A It would be nice to cool off. Oh, <laughs> imagine someone had a new swimming pool. With waterfall feature, infinity edge, and enclosed spiral water slide? That's the one. I'll race you guys there. Not so fast. Okay, I'll let my limited edition Elmata coin decide. Heads, we swim. Ponytails, you lose. Heads. All weekend yeah. pool party. Right, hey, Bruno, you miss me? Home time. <laughs> hey, watch it! <laughs> Bruno, are you okay? <laughs> Did they hurt you? <laughs> Radical. Yo, it's Croco Stylin'. <laughs> Seriously, Shakes? Crocky the smile dial I borrowed it from Klaus. Had it since I was five. <laughs> Looks like you haven't ridden it since then either. Yeah, I never progressed past beginner, so I switched to two wheels. Whoa, oh, 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 oh. Instead of <laughs> dissing my board, how about teaching me some moves? Of course I can show you some gnarly tricks. But... Only if you can keep up. Yes! Whoa, whoa. <laughs> Shove it. Carving. Kickflip. Ghost Holly. Into grind. Hydrant stall. First time. I wouldn't catch up, huh? <gasps> Not bad, Shakes, but we gotta go back to the basics. And for that, there's no place better than the gnarly Ollie Skate Shop. Huh, an original Crocky Short Cruiser. Gnarly. Really? <laughs> no. I tried to tell you, Shakes. So. Let's get him a new deck, some decent trucks, 52 mil wheels. And the rest of the Gromit starter kit? Gromit? Come on, tell me I'm past Gromit. Uh, hold that thought. Mr. Shaw. This is he. Whoa, that's actually pretty cool. The what? The Los Angeles Academy of Magnetic Electrotechnology. We need you to help us develop a new electromagnetic shoe. <laughs> Nah, dude, I'm not the shoe endorsement guy. Seriously, you're the only person with the rad bad skill combo we need. Skateboarding and, uh, uh... uh skateboarding and... Uh, just skateboarding. So, what about it? Deck, trucks, beginner wheels, helmet pads, and... Shove It magazine. No way! That's impossible! Look, dude, if you want to pass on skateboarding's most bodacious breakthrough since the wheel, I guess we could call Liquido. Gotta rain check on that lesson, Shakes, dude. But uh, check out Shove It's triple page spread on moves every grummet should know. I'm in. Great! <laughs> it's gonna be the gnarliest thing I've ever done. May I? I just can't get enough of this pool. Sure, but what about the old pool? Drained it. I'm deciding whether to turn it into a parking garage or fill it with Elmata coins so I can swim in them. Fill it with Elmata coins? I thought you said they were limited edition. There it is. <laughs> a parking garage. Hey! Shakes, Ma. Hey, you Shakes. join us. Oh, oh, brother, are you gonna skate? Or be shot out of a cannon? <laughs> Very funny. Where's Northshaw? Oh, he had to head out of town. Something about the gnarliest thing he's ever done. <laughs> Classic North Shaw. I bet it's a hydrofoil surf boat. Now, now, gotta be stratospheric base jumping. Ha! It's stratos... Stratos... The second one. <laughs> <laughs> Moves every grommet should know. Start with the basics. Ugh, boring. Whoa. Mr. Shaw, 
Welcome to the Los Angeles Academy of Magnetic Electrotechnology. Thanks. You do know that spells lame, right? Yeah. And I don't mean to bust your chops, but did you fly me all the way out to Los Angeles just to ride a half pipe? Ahem. <clears throat> Yanking my chain. Reels free technology. The next level of skateboarding is here. Actually, not quite yet, Mr. Shaw. The Academy has failed to fine tune the maglev ratio mm -hmm. due to trial subjects' inability to maintain equal weight distribution. <laughs> we need a skater with the radical skills to balance how the magnets in the surface help control the metal in the shoe. Well, then I'm your guy. Let's do this. Time to shred. Uh -oh. Oh! 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 Maybe you should call a Quido. Actually, my recalibration seems to have worked. You should be able to do it now. I don't think I can take another fall. I've got a game against Technicali next week. Huh? It should be working now, Mr. Shaw. First time bull rider, start with a low arc. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Dude! One last thing. All this gnarly stuff is highly classified. Sign here. <laughs> Your secret's safe with me! And that's the final whistle, sealing a massive upset for the home team at the hub. I've never seen Technicali move with such grace and speed. Neither has Scar on that. That is what Technicali did to Invincible United in LA this week. And if the boys in yellow beat us, we lose our place at the top of the table. All right, coach, what's the plan? How do we beat them? I've prepared some intensive training for you. We work on speed, passing, and communication. Testing thermal vision goggles for night skiing. Give it a break. I even signed a non-disclosure agreement. What, what, what? Leave him alone, guys. He's had enough of our constant questions. Is it an anti-gravity chamber? A spider silk wingsuit? Dudes, I'm not saying anything. Not what, not who, and not where. We'll soon be touching down at LAX. Welcome to Los Angeles, Super Strikers. And welcome back, Mr. Shaw. Not where, huh? Just stop asking questions, all right? You'll have plenty of time for guessing games at the hotel. Because you're all on lockdown. Ah, come but on. But we're in oh, LA. Get you a ride, sir. No thanks. Got my own wheels, dude. Huh? Huh? Shaw, oh, come on. Wanted to have another little run at it. Huh? <laughs> A little run of what, exactly? Ah, uh, now you're following me around? Nah, I'm just here for my skateboard lesson. Yeah, right. Sheesh, I bet you could fit an indoor skydiving wind tunnel in this warehouse. Nice try, dude. Or even a fake mountain for base jumping? I ain't biting. How about a- Hey! Yep, that's a positive ID. Come on, let's get him! Time for that lesson, Shakes, dude. <laughs> First up, it's the luge!
Awesome move, Shakes, dude! Yep, just like you said, one with a mop of hair, and the other... Hmm, you're right. I don't think there is a name for that. Skating is not a crime, officers! It's for you. Get back to the hotel right now! Pop, shove it into a 50-50 grind with a late flip on the landing. Yeah. Sick move. Telling everyone about the warehouse? Jerk move. Sorry, North. I thought giving them more info would calm them down. But it only made us want to know more. And into a wave pool for kiteboarding? Spider silk big suits? A hot air balloon set free. <clears throat> Maybe it's a massive, high-tech distraction before an important game. Yeah, yeah, Sorry, right, coach. coach yeah. Technically are on form. But with your speed and agility, you can close down their passing options. <laughs> with our speed and agility? There's no way they can stop us! Sorry we ever doubted you, Tony. Your new technique's a total game changer for us. All right, all right. Now get out there and show them what you got! <laughs> yeah, <laughs> and by what you got, I mean what I've given you. <laughs> This isn't so hard. Yeah, how could Invincible unite and lose to these guys? Yeah, <laughs> now, to me! Crack! What? It's John J. Johnson Jr. like a bolt of blue lightning. Whoa, that kind of looked like a shove it. <sighs> Too much skating, North Shaw. Huh? Ollie? <laughs> First half is almost over. And nothing can stop these fleet footed men in blue and yellow. Okay, dudes, I'm ready to tell you about, you know, the thing. What? Really? Now? Your timing is whack, brother. Was it the spider silk wingsuit? Gotta be the amphibious jet ski. Enough! I'm settling this with a flip. <laughs> the truth is, I wasn't snow kiting, wingsuiting, highlighting anything. I was asked to help calibrate a wheels free half pipe. A skateboard ramp with no skateboard, using magnets and metal shoes. Ooh, so that's what was in the warehouse. I was so close. No way. Hey, North, any chance we could try it out? Yeah, where's the skate ramp now? Oh. Yeah, it's right here. It's the hub. Who did you say you helped? Some guy who said he was running a tech startup, okay? A technically startup? You helped our opposition develop technology that allows him to move like ghosts? Are what you the hell? Hell? We're getting thrashed because of you? Sorry, dudes. I can't believe I got suckered in like that. Hey, it only happened because you're such a ripping footballer and skater. Hmm. If only you had metal boots, North. Hey, no matter, dude, how many of those coins do you have? Only the one, North. They're sold out. Obvi. El Matador. <laughs> Special edition El Mata coins, anyone? <laughs> Only one million ever made. Oh, right. Oh, what are you doing? Oh, the grotesque injustice. Nope. This is how the Grom and I... Huh? Grom? Okay, Intermediate Skater and I are going to serve justice to Technicali. And we're back for the second half. Let's hope Super Strikers have a new strategy. Super League Disciplinary Board. Yes, I'd like to report a pitch with some irregularities. Super Strikers are defending in numbers, while Shakes pushes up with a new strike partner. North Shaw? Highly unorthodox, Brenda. 
but an orthodox could be just what Super Strike can need. <laughs> All equal? I've got you, dude. We can do this. Such graceful football now from both teams. What? How did they get metal boots? Hmm. No matter. Shaw just gives it away. <laughs> <laughs> and he steals it right back. <laughs> Finally, Super Strikers are pulling off some epic moves. Ball has gone from graceful to disgraceful. Huh? Oh, 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 oh. Too much maglev power shakes, dude. Let's lose some coins. Way ahead of you. Whoa! Intermediate, no more shakes, dude. Coach, only a regular thing we found is your boys filled their shoes with coins. Highly unusual, but not illegal. Pool party at my place? Ha! Ponytails it is! That coin was in Shake's shoe! <laughs> I thought I told you to burn the infected ones! Nah, you keep them all. Shake on! <laughs> they smell like feet! Get ready for practice! But Tony, we never practice just after a game. Ah! Ah! Please, put us down! Why? This is the closest you fools will ever get to being on top in the Super League! Uh -huh. Ah, changed my mind. Ah! Oh. Four games into your Super League career, and you've won Man of the Match every time. How does it feel to be in the spotlight, Max Power? Well, Rob, pretty rotten, actually. And why's that, Max? Feel a bit bad taking Skara's spot, yeah? It's not his fault he's injured. Feel a bit bad, yeah? Ha! Whatever, schmuck. My injury has helped me relate to people in need. Mega stars with minor injuries? Vince took a risk giving me this chance with Invincible United. I just don't want to let him down. Oh, I'm sure you won't, Max. Although you do have some competition. You having a laugh? Well, with five awards, the only player to win Man of the Match more times than you this season is Shakes from Super Strikers. Woo! Shakes is the best! Well, then it's about time he got to run for his money, in it? Oh, it's time. You got to level with us, Max. How do you run so hard for the full 90? Ooh, now that would be telling, Robbo. <laughs> Shakes. Home time? Yeah, um... Sure. All right, we get it, Shakes. He's your rival for Man of the Match. But, dude, you're obsessed. What? How am I supposed to figure out how he does it without a little research? A little research? Yeah, Shakes. You're taking this rivalry thing to a whole new level. <laughs> what? Shakes, man, you've been here all night? Uh, looks like you've been... busy. I think you've got a problem, Shakes. I know, I know. It probably seems kind of stalkerish. You think? Well, 
Where'd you even find this stuff? Did you go through his garbage? You can tell a lot about a guy by studying his trash, okay? Berserker! Block's right. Why is this rivalry so important to you, Shakes? Meh, I'm just collecting some info on him before the game. If you have to collect something, why not collect Super League temporary tattoos? They're free in this new Berserker gum. Block's grandma sent a whole bunch from Brislovia. <laughs> yeah, it's like chewing an old band-aid. And those tats are lame. Cheap knockoffs. They don't even look like us. Shakes! <laughs> At least your hairdo is improved. Bill <gasps> Matishaw? That's not funny. Le Squido. <laughs> that's better. Uh, hey, Klaus, this one's blank. Oh, that's Invisible United. Very rare. But they use some kind of crazy industrial glue that doesn't come off. I had to scrub my arm for like 20 minutes. That's nothing. Check out my leg. My back. My Whoa, whoa, whoa. If we want any chance of beating Invincible United, we need to do our research as a team. We're in the dying minutes of this match. Huh? Palmentieri Samba style is taking strain. United's new striker is living up to his name. Max Power! Huh. Invitations 23. Attending zero. The defenders just can't keep pace with him. Neither can his own forwards. Oh, oh my! And he still has enough juice left for a gymnastic celebration. And the man of the match is Max Power. That's five wins in five matches for the new United Striker. The kid's a natural, Mac. <laughs> Anyone can win man of the match if they hog the ball all the time. Back off, Skara. What? You gonna side with happy face and new kid over here? Hey, bruv. I've been injured before. It's so frustrating. You got some kind of charity going, yeah? It's an awareness campaign to create awareness for people suffering like me. That sounds great. I'll be there. Cool. Whatever. Nice move calming him down. Just be careful. No one must know. Not even Scar. No worries, Geezer. Mm. I've got this, governor. Thanks to Max Power's stamina, United keep winning matches in the last 10 minutes. We need to identify who's most likely to keep up with him till the end. But coach, where is Dancing Rasta? <laughs> Prof calls it the match activity emulation device. I prefer the Staminator. This is great, Coach Mott. Almost like playing for real. But what about ah! opposition players? Ah, yeah, that. Avoid them or lose points. And when you've reached your limit, hit the stop button. Six minutes at peak speed, but you dip steadily till the 90. Hmm, that's when Max really has to edge. Don't worry, guys. I'm on the case. Guys, help me and Theodore! Dude, you sound like Scar's pathetic awareness campaign. 24 5 side matches in 24 hours. All to raise awareness for megastars with minor injuries. Sounds like a worthy cause. <gasps> we should go! Negatory, Elmada, dude. Max Power and some other Super Leaguers will be there. Well, good luck to those guys. Oh, come on. Don't make me and Theodore go alone. <laughs> guys? Jakes? Mega egos of minor importance? No thanks. Ah, so this is why you're so intent on winning Man of the Match. He's always with me. 
Your dad used to say, keep your friends close and your rivals closer. Maybe El Matador is right. Get close to the man behind the pizza boxes and you could beat him at his own game. one of these before. Everybody's got to do their part, Dingon. Remember, it's for a good cause. <laughs> nice one, Bonesy. It certainly is for a good cause. Chase, huh? you made it. And now you're right next to the guy you've been stalking for the last three weeks. <laughs> hey, it don't hurt to do your homework on the opposition, yeah? <laughs> it hasn't hurt yet. Not bad. All right, campaign supporters. One game down, 23 to go. Grab a snack while the fresh legs come on for round two. So, Shakes, do you want the cheese or the pineapple burger? Huh? Dig in, bruv. Hey, thanks. Hmm, never mind. But don't you usually eat two? Yeah, I always take a double, but today, hey, how'd you know? Uh, read it in a magazine? Yeah, I eat a lot because I burn through tons of calories running around on things, but today I'm taking it chill, yeah? Conserving your energy? Is that one of your tricks for developing stamina? Oh, wouldn't you like to know? How about a trade? I'll show you my famous bicycle kick. For real, mate? Striker's honor. All right, then. Stamina is simple. Just focus on three things. Posture, breathing, and stride. For posture, you have to run tall. Imagine a string holding you up straight. Next is breathing. Keep it steady and deep, right into your stomach. Finally, stride. Make sure your foot lands under your center of gravity. And that's it. Ha! Huh, these chumps. Trying to be best pals? Yeah. Shakes, you can't be buddies with your opponent. Yeah, Max. Where's, Where's your, your loyalty? loyalty? Come on. Nah, no, bruv. Just the one match for me. What? No point tiring myself out before our big game next week. You can't leave. Sorry, mate. I've got. Whoa! Dingo! Huh? Oh no! <laughs> Guys, please help me up. Every man for himself. Shakes, help me, bro. <laughs> Gotcha, bro. <sighs> huh? Come on! <sighs> Jump, <You're> crazy, bro! <sighs> you totally saved my life. You saved mine too. Kind of annoyed, actually. We're starting to enjoy the view up there. <laughs> Oi! Be careful, you bozos. It's minor injuries, okay? <laughs> <laughs> so, you're gonna keep up your end of the deal? Oh, yeah, the bicycle. It's easier than it looks. Jump off your kicking foot, lean back till you're parallel to the ground, and snap! You've got just one chance to make it good. My dad taught me. And your family? They play footy? Yeah, <laughs> even me grandmom, if you count SL4000X. She's wicked good. <laughs> Finally given up, hey, Shakes. <laughs> Remember your theory about altitude training in the Himalayas? <laughs> Guess that one was wrong. He was created by mad scientists! <laughs> Bogus. <laughs> My favorite was, he just drinks a lot of coffee. <laughs> 
Actually, it's none of those things. I got mats to open up to me. It's all about posture, breathing, and strive. You guys like best buds now? Yeah, I saw them sharing secrets and watching sunrises and stuff. <laughs> hey, Shakes, who's that? <laughs> My dad had a mean bicycle kick. Anyway, it's time for a max power failure. Yeah! Let's pull the plug on power. As a sign of unity, we should all wear tattoos of each other. Uh, mm. no, no yeah, tanks, I ma. think I'll pass. Uh, how come Max gets to ride in the limo? I'm the one with the injury. I'm the one who deserves special treatment. Remember, after that stunt at the sky pitch, Shakes thinks you're best pals. Just keep it friendly and he won't suspect a thing. Since their dramatic rescue at Megastars with minor injuries... Shakes and Max Power have become known for their friendly rivalry. Ugh, that's not how you do rivalry. Where's the anger, the venom? The sneaky elbow in the ribs. Yeah, no jokes about his hair, no mockery of his pathetic sports car collection. What gives? Dad? Oh, uh, does he also play footy? Yeah, I told you, the other night. Oh, right, my family plays football too. Yeah, you mentioned that. Klaus, you got some of those tattoos left? Yeah, sure. How many do you want? Hey, whoa, just one. Oh. Huh? Ah! Hey, Max. Nice work out there. Sorry you didn't score. We might be mates off the pitch, Shakes, but not here at... Huh? Oi! <laughs> What's with the cheesy kids tattoo? Klaus is trying to get us all to wear these. They're so lame, and that one's the worst. <laughs> Shakes, we thought you were done with the stalker wall. Yeah, what about the running and the breathing and stuff? At least that made some sense. He was just throwing me off the trail. Well, you can't just go around hugging people, dude. I stuck a tattoo on it. Great. That explains everything. Okay, okay. Check it out. Notice anything? In this one, he's striking with his right foot. In this one, his left. A and look at this. He always eats two of every kind of takeout meal. And he had no memory of what I told him about my dad. You see? He's two different people. <laughs> <laughs> two of everything. Shakes, I eat enough for three people. Honestly, I've forgotten almost all the emotional stuff you ever told me. And Shakes, man, you strike both left and right. Forget Max, brother. Yeah, and the man of the match trophy. And let's focus on winning the game. But if Max doesn't have the tattoo in the second half, Fine. Let's see how your hunch plays out. Let's do it, mate. You see? He's covering his arm because he's second half, Max. That is pretty strange. I'm gonna get close and lift that sleeve. Leave him to the defense! Shakes has been all over Max in this half. The friendly rivalry has taken a turn for the worse. There's that sneaky elbow. Oh, now we're entering the power zone! Where Max's stamina really shows. Oh! Max's incredible stamina is finally rewarded. Maybe we can be strike buddies after all. Max, you're a legend! No, Scar, you're the legend. Oh! Again? My strike buddy better not get all the goals. But Shakes is still not giving up. He really wants that man of the match trophy. What are you doing, Shakes? Huh? What? 
Had to scrub super hard, but it came right off. You think your dad would be proud of you today? Crazy industrial glue that doesn't come off. Scrub my arm with my twin. Check out my leg. My back. My butt. Shakes. Forget Max. Let him have the award, Shakes. It's all good. Cool Joe. Yes. Shake still has some gas in the tank, Mac. Huh. Maybe he was saving it for the final seconds. But can he outrun Max Power? Come on, Shakes. <laughs> Shakes ends Max Power's winning streak. But only just, Mac. <laughs> you did it, Mac. I guess all that investigation stuff paid off. Nailed it. It's not over yet. We can still win this game. Uh, what? Hey, sorry, Max. I know you really wanted that win, but a draw is a pretty good start to a legendary rivalry, right? Yeah, whatever. Huh? Oh, I've been meaning to show you something. Fine. What on earth? Shakes, this is creepy. Ah, uh, you should be flattered. Hey! Oi, not funny, mate! And the Man of the Match award goes to... to... Shakes! Thank you. It's such an honor. But I couldn't have done this without my friend and rival who pushes me beyond my limits. He's twice the man I am. Max Power. Come on up, buddy. This prize is yours. What a loser. Even when he wins. <laughs> uh, let's help him, guys. He's shy. Max Power! Max, Max power. power! Come on! Max Power! Max Power! Max Power! Max Power! Help! I'm in here! Max Power! Max Power! Max Power! Max Power! Max Power! Max Power! Now? Now. <laughs> you got it, buddy. Shakes! Showtime's over, dude! I don't believe it! Huh? No way. There's two of them? Shakes was right! Thanks, bruv. Thanks, Gov. Back off, sir. You gonna side with happy face new kid over here? No one must know. No worries, geezer. I've got this, governor. Twins? Nice one, Giza. Serves you right for not telling me. Two for the prize of one. Give it here, bro. It's mine. Uh, Shakes? Looks like you won the prize and the match. <laughs> Can't believe that punk almost elbowed me out of my team. Ah, those crazy kids. We tried to warn them. Uh, hope I didn't give you the wrong impression, Slick. But we are not friends. I know, but uh, I brought you a gift. Ah! They won't come off! <laughs> nice one, Klaus. Man, that rival thing really worked. Don't think I've ever pushed myself so hard. Sure, but there's a bunch of guys here who can push you even further. Friends close! Rivals closer! Teammates closest of all! Oh, oh, oh. Still close after 90 minutes of football? That's my face! Hit your own! Ladies and gentlemen, it's time now to recognize this season's greatest moments of sportsmanship with the Super League Fair Play Awards. Our first nominee is Nakama's star striker and a true man of honor, Miko Chen! Brussels sprout? Next up, from Barca FC, known for his friendly vibes on and off the field, Riano! Huh? Uh -huh. And our final nominee, whose charisma and noble spirit have captured the hearts of fans and players alike, uh -huh. Shakes! Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Stuffing? Delicious! 
Wait. I'm allergic to walnuts! Ah! <laughs> And finally, public misuse of a meatball at a Super League event. Shakes and Scara are hereby sentenced to a six-month ban. What? Order. You're banning my Star Striker a week before we play Super Strikers? Order! With respect, Your Honor, six months is a long time, and it won't solve the conflict between the players. You didn't let me finish. The sentence is a six-month ban, or we can try something a little more experimental. In extreme cases, the disciplinary board has used a specialized institute to achieve more dramatic results. A Swiss institute? They are impartial, clinical, and highly effective. All arrangements have been made. However, we can't move forward until you approve their treatment plan. We're listening. You two got lucky. The judge reduced your sentence from a six-month ban to a week of conflict resolution. I guess that's good news, but what about practice? The Derby's in a week. We can't say any more. It's all up to you guys now. Play nice, okay? Thought you two'd never wake up. Are we in Switzerland yet? Nope. We're flying over one of the world's last protected rainforests. Miles and miles of uninhabited wilderness. Wow. Uh, who are you? I'm Nisha from the Swiss Institute. Hey, uh, Nisha, what's that for? Oh, that's just one of our collaboration tools. Ah, a little back and forth passing, eh? Well, it's not quite that simple. You have to keep it in motion for 12 hours straight. Sounds simple to me. Hey, you can't just put it in a handbag and go for a walk. You must make boot contact at least every 10 seconds or the ball shuts down and they revert to the six month ban. Huh? Uh, they'll explain everything at the Institute. I've said too much already. Yeah, how about you stick to flying the plane? Take it easy, Prince Charming. We're only here because you started a food fight. You deserved it after what you did to get your precious fair play award. Whatever, dude. I was just trying to help. <laughs> I hate to interrupt. We have a problem! Uh, We're gonna have to jump! What? <gasps> no way! Just do what she says! Don't lecture me! Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Uh, oh. Mind if I borrow this? Sarah! Hey! Whoa. Got any spare parachutes? Mayday, mayday! Oh. We're losing out! Bail out! Bail out! Bail out! I know some of you will see our next fixture as a grudge match. Uh-huh. Well, yeah. It kinda is. Invincible United is going down. Especially after what their captain did to the Klaus dude in that food fight. What? Ah, my lip! That pesky walnut allergy. <laughs> Guys. Our approach will be cool and professional, combining the four fundamentals of football. Skills, training, strategy, and teamwork. So what about Shakes? The brother's still on the team, right? That is entirely up to him. Would be nice to still include him in our game plan. Ta-da! It's Shakes, dummy, just like the real thing. Not quite. <laughs> Even better than the real thing. Ha! Nice landing! Whoa. Stupid tree! Whoa. This wilderness is pretty wild. And a long way from Switzerland. Guess we'll be missing the Derby after all. Come on, if we can get to the plane, we've still got a chance. The plane? Which has a radio and is exactly the reason I was going to suggest we go there. So Vince, I assume you've got some kind of plan for the Derby. Yeah, what are we going to do about Skara? Don't worry, boys. I've dealt Skara a perfect hand. And if he plays his cards right, we'll crush Super Strikers this weekend. I really miss him. <laughs> and all the funny names he calls me. <laughs> no one said you could speak, dingus. Yeah, shut your pie hole, you big dope. That's so sweet, you guys. But it's just not the same. Ha <laughs> ha. 
Bad idea, dude. These make you fart like crazy. Not me. it all falls apart without number four, teamwork. Yeah, the whole team. Pulling together as one, no man left behind. Relax, huh? guys. You don't need me. El Matador will score all the goals. Ah! No sign of the pilot. Misha, she made it out in time. Maybe she went for help. I wouldn't count on it. You're right. We still need to get a signal out. How about we set these alight? Hilarious. Besides, this whole crash site's a smoke signal and no one's come for us yet. What we need is something like... Huh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> so much for airplane mode. Aha! Food! This will be useful. Stop the party, Shakes. Think I just found our ticket out of here. The Swiss Institute ball? If they can track data in the ball, maybe they can use it to track our location. Not bad, dude. Great. Let's kick this thing off. Wait, Whoa. wait, wait. Remember what Nisha said. If it stops for more than 10 seconds, the ball shuts down, and they won't be able to track us. Yeah, yeah. What's your point? We have to nail this the first time. We're tired now. No chance we'll keep the ball moving for 12 hours straight. We can start tomorrow at first light. Nuh uh. No way I'm spending a night in that plane with you. There's just no way. Hey, so, real talk. Why'd you throw that meatball at me the other night? Ugh. I mean, the Brussels sprout I can understand. It's small, round, smells like a burp. I mean, who eats Brussels sprouts? It's like they're designed to be thrown. But a meatball? Come on, man. Those things are delicious. Hey, can you keep your whining down to a low grumble? I'm trying to sleep. Was it my fair play nomination, or, or was it because of what happened in the game? What you want from me, man? Yeah, I had a shot at winning that game, but I screwed it up. That's it, the end. So if you're trying to create some sappy moment where I tell you I admire your fair play reputation and wish I could be more like you, and then we realize we're more similar than we ever thought and should actually be best pals, forget it. I'm not that guy, and this isn't that moment. and your seatbelts, we're heading into turbulence! What? Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Whoa, the ball's moving. Why is it still counting? Boot contact! Quick! Jeez. This won't be easy, but if we work together... Don't worry. I got you. Nice juggling. Too bad you joined the Super League. You could have been a world-class circus clown. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Hey, we got our boots mixed up. Let's swap back. Sure. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> On second thought, let's keep it going. Yeah, and maybe you take the first shift. Okay. I'm going to do a supply check. The terrain's pretty rough around here. We need level ground, open space. All we got are water biscuits and some canned turnips and gravy. <laughs> pretty dry for <coughs> water biscuits. <laughs> Ugh, smells like a wet tennis ball. <laughs> Man, just think of all that awesome grub we threw away in the food fight. That was some luxury cuisine we wasted. Meh, totally worth it. <laughs> <laughs> Where are you, bro? <laughs> what did you call me that day? Oh, yeah. 
moron. Numbskull, frog-faced, dumpster fart. That was a good one. The mobile phone you have called is not available. Still no answer from Shakes. The judge warned us about that. The Institute confiscates phones. It's nothing to worry about. Just think, guys. But would Shake say if he was here? Ha! I've got the perfect thing. My new voice mimic app. Come on, guys. I've got an idea. Come on, guys. I've got an idea. Ooh, I That's classic Shake. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Uh, don't worry, Coach. I got this. Don't worry, Coach. I got this. Sorry, guys. Sorry, guys. Trust me. Trust me. I figured it I out. I figured it out. Watch this. I knew it. El Matador is the greatest. What? He says that a lot. <laughs> like, a lot, a lot. Incoming. And back to you. Hey, look! There's a clearing! That should make the whole keep the ball moving thing easier for you. I mean, us. Eight hours to go. But we need to find another way around. What if a train comes while we're crossing? There'll be nowhere to go. Come on, Shakes. Don't wuss out on me now. Trains, Trains are like payphones and CDs. Sure, they exist. But nobody uses them anymore. Huh. I bet there hasn't been a train on these tracks for years. Please tell me you just ate some more berries. <laughs> Looking for me? Huh? Sorry, man. Guess I kind of panicked back there. You okay? I'm good. Could use a little help, though. Just like payphones and CDs, huh? All right, all right. You saved my butt back there. What do you want? Another fair play award? So that is what's been bugging you. Hey, I'm pretty shaken up from that close call. Would you mind? Thanks, bro. So, you ever gonna tell me what's going on? Where's all this hostility coming from? Uh, you really wanna know. It's not about the goal I missed, or how everyone laughed at me. It's not even about the stupid fair play award. What bothers me is your attitude. My attitude? You know what I mean, that thing you do. Oh, look at me, I'm the poster boy for good sportsmanship. I don't eat poison berries. I know all about trains and I always do the right thing. You're mad because I helped you up? I'm mad because you think you're better than me. I don't think I'm better than you. To be honest, when you're not around, I don't think of you at all. The signal. You called it. Nice one, Skara. Duh. Nisha? You're all right! Well done. You've completed the challenge. Huh? Yeah, so the plane didn't really crash. What? Standard procedure. Deploy fake engine smoke, drop the passengers, and fly low behind a mountain while your team rigs a replica crash site. Which brings us to this. Uh, you boys get along okay? Well... Are you kidding? Two days of bro bonding in the wild? We're best buds now. Glad to hear it. Your coaches were willing to try anything to avoid the six-month ban. They were in on it? Oh, <laughs> those sly coaches. We had fun though, right, buddy? Fun? Dude, you... you... Oh, forget it. Can we please just go home? Match day at Striker Land. Invincible United take on the men in red for a place at the top of the table. But after some off-field controversy... You mean that epic food fight, Brenda? Super Strikers have left their leading goal scorer on the bench. Coach, Skara and I really did try to work together. Why are we still being punished? Huh? <laughs> hey, 
Skara isn't being punished, Jinx. What? Just you. But, but why? After your dismal effort in the jungle, you're lucky to still be on the squad. My dismal effort? The Super League recommended a full pardon for him and a couple of games on the bench for you. And I agree. Ah, uh, but... Keep your emotions in check, Shanx. That's what got you into trouble in the first place. <sighs> it's just not going to be the same without him. Who? That ridiculous airbag with a broom for hair? Or the shakes, dummy? <laughs> with shakes, without shakes, we're still gonna crush it. Yeah, makes no difference to us. And they're off. The Derby always brings out the best in these hometown rivals. And no one enjoys the competition more than Scar on that. Perhaps not today, Brenda. We're in the final minutes of the game, and there's still no score, despite both teams playing their hearts out. The only one not pulling his weight out there is Skara. At least Skara's having a terrible game. Seems without you, he's got nothing to play for. Ugh, it's so unfair. Just look at him standing there, like a waste of space! No point making it personal, Shanks. Personal? Of course it's personal! Skara's vendetta against me is personal. And I personally worked very hard to connect with him and keep that ball moving through the jungle. I know you didn't, Shakes. Huh? Your boots. What about my boots? <sighs> I wasn't supposed to tell you this, but the Institute measured your contributions to the challenge according to boot contact with the ball. That snake! He was wearing my boots! But how did Skara know they were tracking our boots? He knew because Vince wasn't taking notes. He was writing instructions. You're right, Shakes. This is personal. And the fact you did all the work in the jungle might just pay off. Shakes is on the pitch. And Skara looks... Thrilled. Hey! You told the judge you were benching that brat! I hope you brought your pen and paper. You might want to take notes. Shakes is off and firing on all cylinders. Ooh, it's a loose ball! I got it! Finally, Skara springs to life! You made me keep possession for 12 hours straight. I think I can handle a few more seconds. He's not sharing it with anyone. And the men in red win the derby with a sensational goal in the final minute. So, you still prefer the Shakes dummy? Nah, can't beat the real thing. <laughs> Always bounces back. Yup, every time. Captains with more I, discipline. I dare you to say that again! Shakes wasn't even on the field, and you still couldn't score! Don't blame me. This whole thing was your idea! Oh, come on, guys. Stay out of this, you flop your bozo, you big dunce, you, you bone-headed, pigeon-toed, butt-scratching ignoramus! <laughs> if village idiots had their own village, you'd be their king! And what's with the band-aid? Is that from when the doctor removed your brain? Weekend. How do you plan to celebrate? In the 25 years since Grimm joined the Super League, we have developed a reputation for showmanship. Yeah! Yeah! So, we can think of no better way to celebrate than by playing Super Strikers! Super Strikers. 
Because your first Super League match was against the men in red? Precisely. They beat you 2-0 back then. That would definitely dampen the celebrations. Oh, this time we plan to reverse that scoreline. For Grimm! For Grimm! Love that grim spirit. But two nil? No way. Yeah, not with our three striker formation, right, guys? Totally, Shakes. Just get me the ball and I'll score the goal. Come on. If anyone should get the credit, it's Big Bo. Without his rock solid goalkeeping, we couldn't all play forward. Give me a B for Big Bo. He's the hero of this song. And besides his awesome keeping, he's also very strong. Come on, Big Bo. Aren't you excited to be roomies? Well, I did bring noise-canceling headphones to block out all the humming, singing, and incessant talking. Whoa, oh. thanks, Big Bo. Uh, Don't look at me, brother. I've done my time. He once sang me a lullaby all through the night. Klaus, I'm going to need those back. Whoa, so quiet. Perfect for composing new chants. <laughs> give me a B, give me an I, give me a G, B, O. <laughs> Oh, it's you two. You know who is here, in the crowd. As I expected. Well, try not to cause a fuss. <laughs> Do you know who I am? Whatever. I'm still the greatest player Grimm ever had. <laughs> When they see what I do to Big Bo, they'll be begging me to come back. Welcome to the castle, Super Strikers, where we treasure everything grim. From our countless trophies and the Tactinomicon, to our beloved cauldron and the infamous ghost train. Question, does the ghost train contain any actual ghosts? Grim may have a reputation for being haunted, but that's all superstition. Finally. We have the Hall of Heroes. Batbear, the bright. Nogden, the not so bright. Tim, tiny face Dubinsky. And Neville. Neville? His dad paid for the cauldron. But let me tell you about the man who built the cauldron. Legend has it that when the pitch was laid, the cauldron's groundsman came across a stone of peculiar shape. Though many tried, no man could lift it. None but Mislav Markovich. Whoa. Whoa. Dude, shred it up. Awesome. Ah. That's going on Natter. I'm making my own Hall of Heroes. <laughs> Where's the stone now? Some say it was lost when the cauldron was revamped. Others say it never existed. Uh, Coach Belmont, it looks like someone's been removed from the Hall of Heroes. Everything even associated with Spike Dawson is strictly banned from these grounds. Whoa. Heavy. But... He deserved it. Yeah. Right, Big Bo? I've moved on. I'm sure Spike has too. This disguise, our fancy dress costume, was useless. Please accept our apology, sir. You can have another one on the house. What else you got? Mort! What you got? Sorry, Mr. Dawson. All the other costumes are booked out for the big game. What about... Hey, why are these in the bargain bin? That's the garbage bin. Ah! Here I am with the perfect plan to help Grim beat Super Strikers, but I can't get my message to Big Bo because my only way past security is a pink bunny suit! Why don't you just call him? Huh, nice cover. <laughs> yeah, we have costumes for everything, even phones. Nope, those are for display purposes only. All we've got left is this. You know what? I'll take it! And the bunny suit! Hey! For Grim! For Grim. Can you at least deliver this peace offering to Big Bo for me? Ah! <laughs> If I can't go through security, I'll go under it. 
No one knows these grounds like old Spike. <laughs> Cooler than a cucumber and sharper than a cactus, Zero runs his number because he likes to practice. So let's go, Big Bo. Good luck for the game. Thanks, Klaus. Oh, hey, where's the fruit come from? Huh? If it wasn't you, then... The cauldron is haunted! Ah! <gasps> hmm. Dawson. A simple thank you would suffice. What do you want, Spike? I want you to understand how important this game is to Grim. Grim wants nothing to do with you. Oh, that'll change when I tell everyone your secret. What secret? Ever since you injured your wrist a few years well, ago... Uh, I'm sure Klaus doesn't want to hear about that. My secret. And soon, so will everyone in the Super League. What? I'm gonna post it on Natter. Fine. What do you want me to do? I'm gonna take you on a little tour. At the end, there'll be a question. Get it right, and I'll cancel the post. <sighs> Where do we start? Pull on the candle holder. Oh. Um... Not that one. Whoa! Big bow? <gasps> Big Bo is a ghost? It's time for the real Grim Tour. Right. First up, calling the stadium the cauldron. That was my idea. And eating all those ice lollies? Also your idea. Maybe. Next up is the famous ghost train. My idea. And finally, Grim FC's legendary showmanship. Your idea. My idea! <laughs> Grim has tried to erase my legacy, but you can't rewrite history! So, who's responsible for making Grim the club it is today? Um, Neville? Careful now, Big Bo. All right, it's Spike Dawson. You bet your life it's Spike Dawson! So, are we done? Oh, there will be two more lessons. Answer the banana within three rings, or the post goes live! Wait, how do I get out of here? Oh. Huh? Hmm, back of the Hall of Heroes. Third striker coming through! Huh. Yeah, the three-striker formation is rocking, dudes. Well, it's easy when there's no one to stop the ball. Klaus, huh? where's Big Bo? I don't know, Coach. He disappeared, just like a girl. Sorry I'm late, Coach. I got a little lost. All right, well, let's get on with it. The three-striker formation is working great! It's not our fault we've got the best goalie in the Super League! Yeah, as long as he doesn't disappear again... Uh huh? Huh? Big bow! The guy could stop a freight train. He could catch an aeroplane. Isn't that... <laughs> Get back, Ghost of Shakes! It's me, dude. Big Bo's gone missing. Again. Step onto the plate, Big Bo. The Skull Stone? Huh? Come on, Spike. If you want to play footy, just ask. Oh, we're playing. A game called What It Feels Like to Be Spike. Uh, Weighed down by the burden of unrealized talent, I couldn't move forward. Instead, I spent my time watching and re-watching every game you played. I noticed something everyone else missed. How good I look in tights? Your weakness! In five minutes, that cannon will fire. Save the goal, or I release your secret. <laughs> and if I can't lift the stone? Then you'll stay down there and be forgotten. Just like they forgot old Spike.
guess this means you post my secret on Natter. Not if you've learned your lesson. Whose career did you destroy? Oh. Say it! Spike Dawson. Correct. All right, what's my final challenge? Oh, I'm saving that for tomorrow. But tomorrow's the game! <laughs> So, you think Big Bo is a ghost? I know he's a ghost! But he is alive, yes? How'd he suddenly become a ghost? Maybe he was touched by another ghost! I don't think that's how ghosts work. You're thinking of vampires, Klaus! And werewolves. And zombies. You're telling me those monsters can make other monsters, but ghosts can't make other ghosts? Enough it is. There's no such thing as go- Ghost! <laughs> Not a ghost. We were worried about you, brother. Yeah, where have you been? And why are you wet? You sure you want to know? Of course, Come dude. on, we're yes. brothers. <sighs> a few years ago, I injured my wrist against the upright. It wasn't long before I was back in goal, but Spike had made it his mission to watch my every move. And eventually, he figured out my weakness. What weakness? Yeah, you are the best. Whenever I dive low to my left, I hesitate. About one in three shots goes in. <laughs> now, unless I do what Spike says, he'll put my secret out on Natter. You'll be a soft target for the Grim Strikers tomorrow. We'll be lucky if the scoreline is only 2-0. That's scarier than you being a ghost, Big Bo. Hey, we're always counting on you, Big Bo. But tomorrow, you can count on us. Yeah, we'll score a bunch of goals. One each, dude. Yeah. We got you, Big That'll Bo. take the pressure off. Yeah. Give me a beat. Nope. Match night at the Cauldron. As usual, the Grim fans have really got into the spirit of the occasion. And so have the commentators. Right, Mac? Well, I hate to be outdone, Brenda. Too late. Ah! <laughs> <gasps> hmm. <laughs> Guys, footy isn't about how you look. It's about how I look. <laughs> If you see this man, report it to security. Spike Dawson. That weirdo. Some guys just don't know when to quit. Tonight, Venetuvia is like a ghost town. Because everyone's at the cauldron. Yeah, everyone except me. Thanks for nothing, Belmont. Wow, those masks are getting pretty good. <sighs> Gone to the game. Duh. Hm, a little rude. <laughs> yes. Perfect. The first half draws to a close as Super Strikers turn up the heat. But the home team stays cool under pressure. At this stage, uh. it's anyone's game. <laughs> Score for Big Bo! Let's do it! Me first! Okay, fine. Then me second! Uh. Yeah. Come on! Take a mask! That's it! Look at me! Huh? I'm the guy who almost ruined Grim! Free? I wouldn't wear one if you paid me! Dawson is the worst! Arr, I need to get in there! Finally, it's my turn. Oh, and it's Grim on the counter. With Super Strikers bullfitting that attack, they've left gaps in the midfield. Grim closes in on Big Bo. Oh, Grim! What's the last lesson, Spike? Identify my rightful place in Grimm, and you'll get to cancel the post yourself. Hmm, Spike's rightful place. My last challenge is at the castle. But we got you covered, brother. Spike has left me no choice. You won't make it back in time. I know a shortcut. Hey, yo, what do you know? My ruby is the best, and his name is Big... Huh? 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 Hey, you can't go in there! I 
said you can't. Where did they go? That's freaky. <laughs> you hear that? Maybe the cauldron is haunted. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Spike, your rightful place, huh? Don't do it, Meepo! <gasps> Shakes? I know it's gonna give Grimm an advantage, but it's not worth letting Spike control you like this. You can cancel this post, but how will you stop the next one? Or the next? It's another post from Spike Dawson. And if he's right, Big Bo has a weakness to his bottom left. <gasps> Where are they? We can't do this without them. <laughs> How do you keep doing that? Spike was right. One and three goes in. Four Spike. Four Spike. And the fans show their appreciation. There he is. Spike. Four Spike. Cool, man. All right. Give me yeah. one. Looks pretty good. Look at this. <laughs> Finally, I'm getting the recognition I deserve. Hey, I'm real happy for you, buddy. But you're standing on my foot. <laughs> Sorry. Excuse me. Grim is really hammering Big Bo's weak spot. And it's another save. That's two. Will the next one be a goal? <laughs> Super Spike as defenders can see the corner. Belmont is waving his whole team forward. He really wants to reverse the historic scoreline and win 2 0. <laughs> My room is kind of gloomy and sort of acting like a ghost, but I know he'll always be there when his team needs him the most. Don't bother, Klaus. All I've done is let a goal in. I'm not cheering because you never let a goal in. I cheer because to do our best, we need to focus on our strengths, not what holds us back. Besides, your roomies. Release your seat. I hesitate. Your weakness. One in three shots Focus goes on our in. <laughs> <laughs> oh. uh -huh. Nice one, big ball. Epic save, dude. Ruby! It's like trying to find a needle in a stack of needles. This sucks! A draw? Spike Dawson's theory's done nothing for Grim! For Grim! Oh, sorry. No, 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 please! You can kick me out, but I'll be back. You will see! Oh. <laughs> Finally, the skull stone is where it belongs. That's not the only thing that's where it belongs. I guess we pulled it off, Big Bo. I gotta admit, Klaus, you're a pretty awesome roommate. That's very supportive. Could you try it in chant form? I'll help you. It's Klaus, Klaus, MC in the house. Really? You're all ghosts now? I guess this place isn't haunted. Huh? Only two minutes left in this semi-final. And Technicali are in total control. Oh, it's a surprise tackle from Twisting Tiger. Giving Super Strikers their first chance to score. <laughs> uh, but Shakes blows it. He really has struggled towards the end of the season, Mac. He just looks finished. 
Well, now so's his team. Because Technicali's winning streak takes them all the way to the Super League final. Tony, you're a genius, you gotta admit. Technicali and the trophy are a perfect fit. We win the final! Oh. Game over. Let's move. What's this? Super League agents are swarming the pitch! Mr. Ver, huh? Technicali is officially disqualified for using performance-enhancing nanotechnology. Oh, please! I don't know what you're talking about! Tiny bots in your boys' brains. Improving all-round athletic ability. But... Uh, how did you find out? An anonymous tip. Huh? Some snooping busybody snitched on me! <laughs> Super Strikers FC wins by default. What? What? Really, Mom? But why did we have to play the whole game? Lab results only came in 20 minutes ago. Super League Rule 7.94. Never interrupt a match. Report to the Vice next week for the Super League Final. Oh, yes. Not a relief. All that training paid oh, off. I thought we were out for sure. Hooray. Can't wait. Super! Said it block. But coach, you think we're ready for Iron Tank? Yeah, some of us haven't been playing our best lately. Uh, I know you mean me, and I know I've been sucking lately, but why does it even matter? Uh, what are we actually playing for? We play for the team, the fans, the thrill of winning, uh, the lucrative endorsement deals. Okay, sure, those things used to work for me too, but now that I'm playing so badly, I can't think of a single reason to keep going. Ah, uh, Coachman. Maybe Shakes should sit this one out. The pressure's too much for him. It is the final, after all. We have to face facts. The dude just can't hack it. Listen, guys. We're not going to bench Shakes just because he's not playing well. He's been with us every step of the way this season. And now we need to support him. So he'll be in the starting lineup this weekend. And all we have to do for the final is apply the four fundamentals of football. Skills, training, strategy, and teamwork. So get out there and play your hearts out together. Yeah! Wow. Woo -hoo -hoo! <laughs> You'll get through this, Shakes. Just keep moving forward. Thanks, Coach. I'll do my best, but I think this will be my last game. Iron Tank have fought hard for their place in the final. And Super Strikers look ready for an epic clash. It's the stuff of dreams. Fantastic interplay from Super Strikers. Come on, give them a chance. Strike. Should have kept his head down over the ball. <laughs> Rookie mistake from Shakes. Something's up with Shakes. Maybe he just needs a new cheer. Shakes! Shakes! He's got what it takes! 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 Look who's away. Hey, man. You had us worried there, buddy. Glad you're back, Shakes. <sighs> Did we win? Uh, we lost, dude. But don't worry about that. Yeah, you got bigger problems. Just relax, Shakes, man. Problems? What are you talking about, Ty? Huh? Handcuffs? When the doctors scanned your head after the concussion, they found performance-enhancing nanotechnology. Like Technicali. Dude, maybe you did it by accident. Yeah, someone could have put it in his food. Did you eat or drink anything weird before the final? Guys, how could anyone think my performance was enhanced? My game's been so off lately. People are saying that's the reason you cheated. So, what now? You'll stand trial before the Super League Disciplinary Board. If they find you guilty, You'll be banned for life. Sheesh, but I'm innocent, so we'll figure it out. Right, guys? Um, I, I don't know, man. The evidence is pretty overwhelming, Shakes, mind. Hey, this patient needs rest. Get out of here, all of you. <laughs> <laughs> now just take it easy, Mr. Shakes. Watch some TV. Relax. 
I always knew that loser was faking the good guy stick. We all trusted him. I just feel so betrayed. Super League, take a hint. We know Shakes is innocent. Super Strikers musical? Now, with all new songs about Shakes' tragic fall mm -hmm. from grace. But how do we know Shakes is guilty, Dr. Tonya Verona? We scanned his brain here at Athletech Labs, and the results are irrefutable, Lena. It seems Shakes will retire young and discreet. Hmm. Tonya Verona looks a lot like Tony Vern. Maybe he thinks I ratted him out, and this is some kind of weird payback. 4 a.m., front entrance status report. All clear, boss. Rear fire escape? All clear. Interior lockdown. The birdie is in the cage. Hey, guys, can you keep it down? I'm trying to escape here. Forget it, Shakes. There's no way out. Ah! Whoa! Ah! The birdie has taken flight. Repeat, the birdie has taken flight. Whoa! Carving? Ryan, oh, accidental 360. <laughs> Try the pudding cup. It's delicious. Uh oh. Whoa! Ow. Huh? <laughs> All right. We've got him cornered. South stairwell. Game over, Shakes. Sorry to disappoint you, but the game's just getting started. Birdie has flown the coop. You better get that cleaned up before the boss sees you. Hmm, it is delicious. All right, here's what we know. Our fugitive has a two hour head start. He's fast, fit, and we're in his hometown. But Shakes isn't just another athlete who crossed the line. <gasps> He's one of the world's most recognizable stars, which makes hiding hard. And public transport? Not an option. So he'll need help, people he can trust. Super Strikers, they're like his brothers. We'll stake him out, but he won't go there first. Too obvious, um, rule 43.6. All agents wear black suits. Sorry, boss, I had a dry clean this morning, left it in my car, and it's gone. So our fugitive is wearing a black suit, freshly dry cleaned, and about two sizes too small. What? You waiting for a formal invitation? Get out of here! Go, go, go! Go find him! I didn't want to point out the obvious, but why doesn't he wear a black suit? Special Agent John Hackett always gets his man. And when you're that good, you make your own rules. Shakes is innocent standy? Check. Shakes is innocent online petition? Check. Shakes is innocent snack supply? Double check. Shakes is innocent, period. <laughs> Whoa! Uh. Buddy! Shakes! I thought you would have left town by now. I've been framed, and I'm pretty sure Dr. Tonya Verona, or should I say Tony Vern, has something to do with it. Cheating and technology? It's gotta be Tony. Huh? Super League agents! Okay, uh, I need you to sneak into Athletech, prove the evidence is fake, and call me when you unmask Tony Vern. Call you? I wanna see Tony's face when you catch him. <laughs> <laughs> you have three seconds to open this door! Or you won't have a door. One, two, Three! Yeah! We're looking for shakes. The shakes? Here? <laughs> In my little old place? Unlikely. Well, um, yes, he was here. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> Go, shakes! Sorry, I'm a fan. Move, move, move! <laughs> Dude, you're blocking my awesome getaway! Shakes! Uh-oh. Whoa! Whoa! The birdie is not in the vehicle. <laughs> After a dramatic hospital escape, Shakes is on the run with Agent John Hackett in hot pursuit. Hey, Vanessa, isn't that our house? Oh, please. Don't be such a doofus, Terry. Huh? It is him! Whoa! whoa, whoa. whoa. Huh? Go, Shakes! The 
the secret to a great barbecue is never take your eyes off. Coming through. Hey, my chicken! Is Tony Vern's nanotech making shakes faster? Hard to say, but he's certainly staying ahead in this foot chase. Hey, you there! <laughs> yes! You didn't get your visitor's passes. Without these babies, you wouldn't have access to all the labs. Huh. Thanks. Wait a second. Each pass is valid for a free cappuccino at the cafeteria. I always forget that part. End of the line, Shakes. Come on, I could really use that proof now. Buddy. Spencer, Bram. You won't believe what we got, Shakes. What, Spins? What? Free cappuccinos. <sighs> Gotta admit, you're pretty fast, kid. But now everyone gets to see us take you in. Come on, Shakes. They've really got him now. But it is better if they bring him in, right? At least he'll be out of danger. <laughs> what? <laughs> this is a joke to you? We've got you surrounded. You're not from around here, are you? Well, this is where I grew up. My elementary school is right around that corner. And the field where my dad taught me the bicycle kick? Just two blocks from here. That's real sweet, kid. <laughs> You're missing the point. Home, ground, advantage. And old Jimmy, the school bus driver, he's a real stickler for punctuality. No! <laughs> <laughs> Kowalski, <gasps> Shakes, here it is. All right, and the scan's clear. Shakes is innocent. Oh, hello, Tonya Verona. Oh, it's showtime. <laughs> well, well, well. Famous soccer star, still trying to get a free ride. Meh. Don't ever let him keep you down, Shakes. Thanks, Jimmy. Ah, just in time for the main event. Doctor. Or so you claim. <laughs> you can call me Tonya. How can I help? By telling the truth, Tony. Huh? <laughs> oh. oh no. We are so sorry. You're not Tony Vern in disguise. You sound disappointed. I assume it has something to do with Shake's scans. Well, yeah. Why'd you tell the Super League Shakes has nanotech in his brain when the scan is obviously clear? You must remember, it is nanotech. Whoa. The bots find their way to the Medulla Footballata, where they enhance all-round athletic ability. You got them out, right? Yep, and handed them over to the Super League as evidence. I'm sorry, buddy. We're, we're not giving up, Shakes. Thanks, guys. You've, you've done everything you can. <sighs> hmm? Come home, Shakes. We're worried. Come home, Shakes. We're worried. Come home, Shakes. We're worried. Any activity? Nope. Just the saddest barbecue I ever spied on. Guys, imagine how he feels out there, all alone. He needs us, Coach. I know. As his team, we have to support him. And the best way to do that is to help the authorities bring him in safely. He'll have a fair trial, and I'll make sure he doesn't get hurt. Hey, why are there two twisting tigers? <gasps> Shakes? What? Wait! Hey, Shakes! Shakes! Come back! You all betrayed me? No, Shakes, man. It's not like that. This is for your safety. There's no point running. <gasps> oh, nice one. Sick move. Yeah, go, Shakes! <laughs> the brother still got it. <laughs> My bike, huh? He stole my keys.
Dr. Verona. Now, turn this thing around. But I'm innocent! <laughs> I don't want to fight you. Then you should have stayed in bed! <laughs> Chasing you for the rest of your life. But you gotta ask yourself, what are you running from? From you, duh. You know what I mean. You tried nanotech, but no tiny gizmo's gonna replace what you've lost. You've lost your love of the game. A classic case of burnout. Maybe it's time you move on. Get a commentating gig. Match day at Striker Land. We could even get you a job at Super League headquarters. The birdie is on the team. You'd make one heck of an agent, kid. Me? With your football skills, you've got the four fundamentals down cold. Crazy skills, committed training, smart strategic moves, and teamwork. They were just trying to protect you, kid. Now come on, let's get you a new start. Thanks, but if I'm not playing the game, I want nothing to do with it. Just saying it out loud feels good. I'm done! Woo -hoo -hoo -hoo! <laughs> <laughs> Seems there's not a whole lot left for you at Striker Land. Yeah, even Coach and the guys don't believe me. Hey, what if I tell folks I never caught you? That you didn't make it? Okay. On condition you disappear. Never play soccer again. Hmm. <laughs> Deal. Just make sure Big Bo gets his bike back, all right? You got it, kid. too busy. How about a little help, Dad? Huh? You used to play soccer, right? I gave that up a long time ago. But you always tell me to never give up. <sighs> Fine. Pass me the ball. Yes! <laughs> All right! <laughs> I forgot how much fun this is. <laughs> Dad, the bicycle. Oh, yeah. Jump off your kicking foot. You've got just one chance to make it good. Should watch where you're going, Pipsqueak. You all right, brother? You you guys didn't abandon me? What you talking about, Chicks, man? You took a mighty knock there, dude. Pupils responding normally? Do you have a headache? Feeling dizzy? Nauseous? Never felt better. Great. No concussion. You're sure you don't want to go off? I'm good. I just remembered what I'm playing for. The fifth fundamental of football. Fifth? Yeah. Fun! With the score tied, Iron Tank's defense is sitting deep. Holding on for the penalty shootout. Captain, to me! But Shakes is making a cheeky run. He's in the worst form of his career. But he's smiling like it's his birthday. Whoa, skills! <laughs> Training? <laughs> Strategy? Shakes, brother. Knows a man, Shakes. He's back. Looks like I was wrong, Shakes, dude. Turns out you can hack it after all. <laughs> hack it? <laughs>
You still think this will be your last game? Not a chance. But you were burnt out? Yeah, Shakes. You were like, I'm over this soccer thing. We thought you were going to quit. Come on, guys. Why would I quit? I'm playing the game I've loved since I was a little kid. It's in my blood. Nothing else matters. What? 